when you plan to give a TEDx talk, you also think, how long does it take to become a TEDx speaker? Because you want to manage your time for preparation and at least roughly know when your dream of speaking at a TEDx stage will come true. The time length will be a little bit different for each person. The fastest I've seen was my client who gave a TEDx talk within a little more than a month after she sent her application. But she had a lot of credibility and had her great idea ready, so she even got accepted on the first try when she sent her application. Then, in about one and a half months, she had her talk published online. So the whole process took her about two and a half, three months. If you don't have much experience, you still need time to define what your TEDx talk will be about, or you have a goal to perform at the top event in your region or even a country, then it will take you much longer time, like 6 to 10 months. So how long it takes to become a TEDx speaker will depend on how well you are prepared and how ambitious you are. To give you a better idea of how things work, let me share with you what the whole process looks like and I'll give an approximate time that each step may take. First of all, before you apply for a TEDx talk, you need to prepare information about yourself. Many people will apply for the same TEDx event as you. You need to show the organizers that you are credible to talk about your topic, that you know what you will talk about, that your idea is interesting and that people need to hear your speech. If you want to get accepted to give a TEDx talk, then you better make your application stand out. If you've done some public speaking before or media appearances, then probably you already have your bio and information about you. Then you'll just need to adjust it to your TEDx talk. If you don't have any of this and you're new to public speaking, then I suggest you research how other people do and craft your bio focused on your credibility related to your topic. In other words, information about you should show the organizers why they should choose you to become a TEDx speaker at their event over others. The second thing you need to do before you apply for a TEDx talk is you better outline and even write a draft of your TEDx talk script. Click here to watch my video on how to write a TED talk. Some big TEDx events may ask you to send them a draft of your talk with the application or when they select the speakers. Moreover, when you fill out the application, you will need to write the title of your talk in description. Usually, add the outline of your TEDx talk or the main bullet points and often you'll be asked what's the key idea you want to share, the idea worth spreading. When you have a TEDx talk draft written in front of you, it's much easier to write a description that clearly describes your idea. It will be better if you already have a list of TEDx events that you want to apply for, because often TEDx events have a specific theme. You'll need to adjust your TEDx talk to their theme and make it relevant to their audience. Let's say you want to give a TEDx talk at the university, so you will need to make your speech relevant to both adults and students. Before you start sending your application, I suggest you check this guide on how to become a TEDx speaker, which has a template of what you better write in advance, so later you could quickly use it in your TEDx application. It's free to download. I'll leave a link to it below. So these first two steps, prepare information about yourself and your TEDx talk, might take you up to a month, depending on what you already have ready. Writing a decent TEDx talk draft is the most time-consuming task here. The next step is you apply for a TEDx talk. You can apply for several TEDx events at one time and see which one will accept you. When you have a draft of the information about yourself and your TEDx talk, you just need to adjust it to the application you feel for each TEDx event. The main parts will be similar. Some events may ask you to send them a video of you talking about your idea. Some may ask for more information. So even if you have everything ready, it will take time to fill the applications. This process of applying for a TEDx talk also will depend on how many events you have around you that you want to apply for. If you live in an area where there are not that many TEDx events, then it may take you a few months just because there is nothing to apply for. If I take the US as an example and you are willing to travel to different states, then the application process may take you 
one to three months. To learn how to apply for a TEDx talk, I suggest you watch this video. After you send your application, you need to get accepted for a TEDx talk. Some TEDx events may have one or even a few additional interviews before they decide on the final round of TEDx speakers for their event. Usually it happens with large TEDx events. Smaller events may decide who will become a TEDx speaker just by going through the applications. Sometimes you may find on the TEDx event website the deadline for applying for a TEDx talk and when the event will make the final decision on the TEDx speakers. This process takes on average from one week to one month from the time the application is closed. However, some events allow people to send their applications all year round. If you apply for such events, check if they post on their website or social media when they reveal the speakers for the current year. The important thing to note is that TEDx events look for the speakers several months in advance. Smaller events may do it within one, two months. The big events often look for the speakers six months in advance. So if you want to become a TEDx speaker, plan your time ahead. Once you get accepted for a TEDx talk, you'll have time to polish your speech. You'll need to finish your script and then rehearse your talk. When you will give a TEDx talk, you won't be allowed to read from a paper. You will need to memorize your script. This time will depend on how long in advance a TEDx event looks for the speakers. So you may have about one to five months for preparation. The next step is the best one. It's when you finally give a TEDx talk. The event will take one day or even one evening. Most people think that this is it. But you want to show it to more people, you want it to get published online. This is the final step of the process. After you give a TEDx talk, the organizers will edit the video and then upload it to the TED system. In a while, TED staff will publish your talk online. It may take from a few weeks to about one and a half months before your TED talk goes live. As you can see, the time for the whole process of how to become a TEDx speaker will vary and depend on different factors. The better you prepare before you apply for a TEDx talk, the faster you will become a TEDx speaker. Also, once your TEDx talk goes live, there's even more you can do. If you want to get more views for your TEDx video, then learn how to promote your TEDx talk after it gets published. Watch this video next.